read the Trump indictment. I did. Okay. I did. How did you feel about that? Well, I'm not a lawyer. So, I mean, I'm not a lawyer. But I did. I did read it twice. And I need to read it again. And okay. somebody have to explain it to me. But I'm not a lawyer. And I think it's very professional. I hear that it's a co talking or talk talking in, in diamond so basically it's, it's reading for people like like us for the consumers you know the regular people it, just, it gives a lot of detail right okay so that's about it okay um, i know it's a 37 counts and you know i i just know so you think it's a ju you think it's justified though well this is what i think i trust the democratic institution in this country and I do trust this country and the, you know, so I trust the political system. It can be improved, uh, but it's, it's, it's beautiful and it's working for everybody. Uh, he's he's so not he's, cute until he finds other wives and he has his day in court today, like you and I, uh, I at least I have. So you feel like Biden's done a great job for America now? I think Biden is, this is what it is. I think Biden is, doing the most important job that any president should do, should be doing. Just like Ronald Reagan did, George Bush, Clinton, Obama. He's keeping his Ice mouth shut and he's working and passing law. I don't have to be agree with those laws. Okay. Because in four years, I can vote him out. But he's American president. So you don't- He doesn't talk. So it doesn't matter what the result of the laws he's passing? Well, no, it does matter, but, but, but. He is a president for everybody, right? He just he's, a president he's, he's for governing. Everybody. Okay. This is what he's doing. He's governing, and and that's the important thing. The next election, if I don't like what he did, I'm gonna vote him out. So would you vote for him again? At this point, absolutely, absolutely. What would be two major reasons why you'd vote for him again? Why two major reasons? Two well, major first, reasons. I I think the environment is is key for me, and I think. The, the instability of the government is, is important because if you don't have trust in your government, you have a stability, you always have drama and blah, 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 blah. So you, feel you like lost the democracy. You feel like the government is more stable now than when Trump was president? Absolutely. But, Absolutely. The, but the thing is this. You don't have to take my word for it. Okay. I mean, they think you're asking a, a guy who, with a pig head and, and, and nobody. I mean, people should go and read. People should go and get informed themselves, but you know what? That even doesn't matter because people are clinched to their to their emotion and to their drama and their identity crisis. So everybody's going to do what they're going to do. So if you found out that Biden committed the same crimes that Trump did, do you feel like he should be indicted tomorrow? Absolutely. And thank you for you asking me. The, listen to me. Out of everybody here, you ask the smarter question, man. Even even Rauder, even. I, I swear that. to God, no, I appreciate that. That's that's very good. See, I saw Luke, man. I'm not married to him. So you think he should He's be not my kid. If, if he if he committed the same crimes, he should be he should be prosecuted. Absolutely, but okay. but wait wait. But I don't know. This is a technicality, right? It's not a crime of to prove guilty, right? Well, he 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 had classified documents, just like Trump had classified documents. So well, it's not the same. Well, no, it's not okay, the same. So it's a self reporter, right? And he's self reported by his lawyer. Trump didn't cooperate. I agree. Right so and the so amount is right. different, and the you know what I mean. Yeah. Okay. The, the law is, is is clear right there. Okay. After after 19 after it was passing in 78, after 91, starting with Reagan, all the presidential documents are public, right? And that's it. You don't have to take anything wrong. But if you did, let's say if you did, but it, you cannot compare. You cannot compare Pence with Donald Trump. It's totally different. Okay. Trump and Pence. So let's compare these two then. Let's compare. Let's compare Ron DeSantis and Donald Trump. Who do you think would be better for the country today? Well, none of them represent the vision of the country. So uh, you say but not wait, wait. Trump or so no, Trump I, or I think I, this is what we think. None of them represents the vision of the country that I want to leave. But Ron DeSantis is not a dictator. Ron DeSantis is having done the things, you know, he has improved himself to do that. You know, it did something. So you don't like the way that he went Florida? It is something, it is something that he did a couple of things that is undemocratic, especially with the case of Disney World retaliation with the company. Okay. You know, even even so you talk about Disney. That, you talk about Disney. Yeah, I talk about Disney. But, but the, the thing is this, wait, wait. But and I don't take sides. And 
I'm not a Democrat or Republic. I'm a no party affiliation. I just like to be, I just like to believe. Man, I come from Cuba, man. I need peace. Okay. So, but, I need oh, fucking saying, peace. So who do you think? No, I'm saying. I need peace. So, and relax. A normal government. So you don't think that either, either Republican candidate could do a good job of running the country? I didn't say that. Well, I'm I saying, say the two choices you gave me? Yeah, so you wouldn't choose that either. None of them. But I, no. So but who on the, Democrat, the Democratic Party represents you? Who in the Democratic Party would you say represents you? Who in the Democratic Party would you say represents you? Well, Trump. I mean, a, a party is an ideal, right? It's not my party because I don't. This is why this is everybody learns something or pick up stuff. Because I'm from Cuba, I tell this to myself. I don't fall in love or commit to any party or political ideology. It's about solving problems. We have in Miami oh, Day a traffic be, problem. Oh, Let's fucking solve people. that traffic problem. That's it. Okay. You know what I mean? So we, we definitely have a heat problem right now. Let's solve that heat problem. And it's not a you, me, this, this, this is just bullshit, man. Well, I'm saying you got to pick a candidate, it's, though. This is, I, I, I would pick a candidate with the time comes. Okay, so, the, in the next election, so you don't I'm, care who becomes. Why, why? Listen to me. Why we are going into? Well, no, I'm saying because it, this no, is, it's, because I'm just trying to ask because the thing is, it's like you have to. There are candidates that get elected in the primaries, and you know before. I don't that, vote so in the primary. We'll see. So that's what I'm saying. So you get whoever I don't they give you. I'm not part of any party. So I you don't care who the Democrats. So you don't care who the Democrats give you to vote. No, for. I do care, but I just not involved in the party. I I like. I think we should develop a different system. With no okay. party affiliation, everybody can vote for the best person and we have less bullshit around, right? Yeah, I agree with that. So, I mean, I'm just one problem to be solved. And I don't want, I want people to be happy, but your identity crisis? Doing a different way, man. I don't know. Whatever you want to do, but just don't bring it to the, you know? It's so just, you're against identity politics, basically? I totally against it. I mean, because it's not, this is nothing. You know what I mean? Okay. How many times I change identity? So you think, you, it's you think it's divisive to the country? It is divisive to the country. And they know it. And but they enjoy it. Who, do you, who, who enjoys it? Whoever is doing it, they enjoy it. Everybody who do it. If you do something, you enjoy it. They, they enjoy it. So you, you think cool it's a, to you, not cool cool to you. Yeah, yeah. So you think it's a multi-party thing? You think it's like a multi-party thing? Or you think it's just like one side? No, I think uh, both party has, uh, you know, the every party. Everybody. Everybody would, they say, if you have this person who does uh, a lot of... Uh, volunteer work or right uh, you know it's passionate about that right so i see in both parties some group a small pe group of people are very passionate about it right. so you think there are a lot of them because they make a lot of noise but they're not you know what i mean okay so it's like chihuahua oops that's it that's, that's <laughs> it that's what it is you know so you're saying basically nip it in the butt now or just kind of let it do what it does I mean, control I, or no control, basically. Control what? It's I'm saying control. the situation. I mean, are you gonna control? I mean, if you control it, we in Cuba, right? Or back to leave it time. I mean, what do you want to do? Okay. I mean, I agree. I agree. I don't know what to say. <laughs> say hello to my little friend. The <laughs> fuck <laughs> I know. All right, man. Well, I appreciate talking to you. By the way, this not oh, a Oh, do you want to explain the the, the pig no, head real quick no, for everybody? No, no, no. Okay. That's what they're gonna do. You gonna All right, y'all gotta do your own research on the pig head. Yeah. Do your own research. Lord of the Flies here. Lord of the Fly, baby. Lord of the Flies, man. I appreciate chopping it up hey, with your big dog. Oh, yeah, I for sure. It.